What's up guys, it's Leroy Jenkins here for another video, of course, a Los Angeles County video. And guys, you may be wondering why am I in front of the California Highway Patrol Central Division building? Well, I'm going to tell you right now, because I, Leroy Jenkins, am now, if you check here, bam, am on the California Highway Patrol team, baby, woo woo. CHP, baby, this is the best, man. I've, In my opinion, in my personal opinion, I believe they have the best siren in the entire 50 United States. I think they have the best siren in the entire world, in my personal own opinion. They are the best. They are the best. Oh, my gosh. They're so amazing. But, guys, let's go ahead and click on this uniform. Bam. Look at that nice uniform. We don't really need the hat. But we're going to get the hat because I, I don't really see a lot of people wearing this hat really that much. You know, that often they're not usually wearing a hat. At least I don't think they are. But, you know, because most of the time it's usually motorcycle units that are, you know, pulling people over and so on and so forth. But like I said, guys, you also saw me take a picture of a CHP Tahoe. You also saw me take a picture of a CHP Charger. You also saw me take a picture of a CHP Explorer. So, yes, they all, they all, what's it called? They all, you know, exist out there. Except I never really see them that much, like, on a traffic stop. Well, I haven't really been pulled over, anywho, by CHP. I've never been in a car that's been pulled over by CHP. So, but, you know, it is what it is. Here we go. Let's get this. Open up this thing. And let's get ourselves a good old-fashioned. What's the newest thing? 2018 CHP Polar Bear. We can do that another day. Let's get the full Mark FPIU, man. The, the Explorers are growing on me. They're growing on me over the Chargers. Also, they're growing on me more than the Chargers because, believe it or not, guys, CHP gets V6 Chargers, not V8 Chargers, which technically means, or at least according to some of the officers that I talked to, it feels like the Explorer has more get up and go. It feels like it, the acceleration on the Explorer is better than a Charger. I'm like, are you serious? An Explorer is better than a Charger. And ever since I heard that, I have just been, you know, forever just listening in. You know, maybe an Explorer isn't that bad. You know, maybe it's time I let go of my love for Chargers in exchange for a love for Explorers. You know, they're, they're growing on me. You know, the Charger is slowly, slowly fading away, fading away, fading away, fading away. And what's it called? Ooh. You got a 40 miles per hour speed limit. Nice. But guys, I think I know a reason for why they use V6s instead of V8s. Once again, this is more of me talking to the cops because I used to ask. Or I still do, but I asked like a couple cops. Ooh, what is that car? Let's make a good old-fashioned U-turn right here. And let's check that car out. Let me just see what that car looks like. Because if that is what I think it is. Oh, man, that's going to be. Let me see that. What are you looking like? What do you? What is this? What does this say? Sheriff. Oh, what is that? big yellow line underneath that sheriff car looks dope it looks dope man it looks really dope dude really and truly dope that's all i'm gonna say all right 50 miles per hour speed limit we're going over the speed limit where is this going this is going to nowhere let's make that good old-fashioned u-turn i just want to see that sheriff car if i'm being complete and utterly honest that's all i wanted to see but anywho as i was saying um they use it for gas mileage they use a v6 instead of v8 for gas mileage so they're able to get more miles on the gallon so on so forth so we don't have to spend as much money on gas because it's much oh that's my bad hopefully nobody saw that hopefully nobody saw that because chp is supposed to have pristine driving and that my friend was not pristine driving why am i hearing stuff oh also uh something else that i get for you know being included as part of the chp team i don't know what this guy's doing you have fun with that is uh guns 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 galore guys let's go ahead and pull on over to the side of the road here because this is the closest thing they have to a highway it seems i also don't know where let me see that's an lapd car that's the c there's the chp car i'm like there he is all right can i finally go okay i'm oh my goodness go nope that's not it uh is it is it is it j there you go we're gonna click j there we go let's click j there we go. Let's pull into this parking lot. Hopefully, you dude doesn't follow me. I think he is, though. So, it's unfortunate for me. Sucks to be me. Uh, let's pull in right here. In this Pledis, I think. 
and let's show off some of these guns that you get included as part of the CHP game pass. There we go. Back it up, back it up, back it up. And park it in. I also want to thank the developers because they were very appreciative and, you know, helping me get this CHP game pass so I could review it and show it off to all of you guys. So if you guys want to get this game pass, now you guys know what is in the game pass. Now you'll know. Okay, so here we go. First off, you got a good old-fashioned Glock 17. Also, there is no third-party, uh, no third-person shooting. Only first person. You can also, of course, you can, what's it called? You can uh, right-click to zoom in. You can use Q. No, Q is, oh, dang it. Q is for this and that. So, unfortunately, you cannot use Q, but Q does do something. At least it's not like it does nothing. But yeah, use right-click to zoom in. And why I may be asking about Q and so on and so forth is because for those of us, because before I actually had a separate mouse, all I had was like a little trackpad on my laptop. So for the most part, I just had to, you know, use the trackpad. And for the most part, I really could not zoom in on shooter games. So that's the only thing. If there's like a way, if there's another button, if you know they already have a button that you can also use for zooming in and zooming out on weapons, you guys could tell me down below because that would really make it, you know, helpful for all the laptop users out there. But for, um, for the most part, at least as far as I know, I don't think there's another button. But you can scroll down to put the weapon down, scroll down again, and it's even further down. And that's basically the same as, you know, like this. Look, when I scroll up, it goes up. So when I scroll down, it's basically doing the opposite of this, where, like, it puts the gun down. So, guys, you got the most amount. I mean, like, everything else does not have this. I don't think there's any, really, any game that have this amount of, like, um, controllability and stuff, dude. Because this is really cool, man. Where, like, you can put the gun all the way up, all the way down. Just by scrolling, and that's probably why it's only first person. You can also do it with this M4A1. Bada bing, look at that, zoom in, you got the little iron sights. I'm assuming that's what these are. And then you can also put it up, and then you put it down. Oh, you put it to the side, nice. Uh, to the side, and also I should probably tell you guys here now. But you can also search people, find people, and handcuff people. Literally, I could set him a fine for anything. And search him, I can search him right now. Let's click Z. Uh, what happened? He has, what does it say? I don't know how to, oh, search. He has a radar gun on him. Boom. Search is finished. I could find him right now. Reason, um, test. Amount, uh, zero dollars. And then submit, and he'll now get a fine. I'm gonna ask him, did you get a fine? I'm gonna ask him if he got a fine. Yes, no, let's see what he says. That said test on it, did you? I know you did. You better say yes you better not lie because i know it went through so guys be careful if you do find people no oh i guess because i put it for zero dollars it said no um but yeah be careful because you will find people and um just don't find the wrong people make sure of that i just put mine if i ever do it to the wrong people just put it for zero dollars and i think that might be what canceled it out because i'm not going to test it again you know ruin that guy's day but you also get some pepper spray um i kind of want to oh man i'm okay Anyone want to be a test subject? Uh, want to be my test subject? Want to be my test subject? Any of you? Any of you want to be my test subject? How do I turn my flashing lights off? Uh, press J. J. Here you go. There you go. Want to be, want to be my test subject, dude? Nope. Okay. Okay. Tell me what you see. Okay, tell me what you see, dude. Tell me what you see. All right. Pepper spray him. There we go. Oh, okay. That did something. What do you see? What do you see? What do you see? Uh, what do you see? Say something, man. Because that definitely did something. I don't know if it just made him sit down or if it entirely messed up his screen because he might not be able to see me for now. But I don't know how long that thing lasts. So for the most part, I'm just going to leave that guy there until he comes to his senses. But he also got a good old fashioned radar gun. Just like everywhere else. You can use it in the car. You can detect speed. Uh, can I detect that guy's speed? Yes, I can't. Oh, can I detect this patient's speed? Right here? I think I have to reset it. Blue. He said he saw blue. I don't know what that means, but you, you have fun with your blue, dude. Let's see. Um, I don't know how to use the radar. Let me be completely honest. But we'll, do, we'll look more into that later. Next. Police baton. I can do this. It does that to him. I'm not going to do it over and, you know, actually damage him. Because, like he said... He's my test subject, got some cones, got bam, cone, bam, and it goes exactly where you put it, bam, 
Can I put it on his head? No, I... Oh, yes, I can! There you go. Bam! Right on his head. What happens if I click on it? Phone goes away. Phone goes away. Phone goes away. And if I want, I can just click this blue button. Boom. They're all gone. Next. Taser. All right. Uh, ready? Oh, I got shot by somebody. Oh, no. Well, that was a... I don't even know where I was. But I just died. And for the most part, dude, that's basically all that we got. But I'm probably going to... Let's go back there, dude. I am not... There's no way you're just going to shoot me and get away with it. No, sir. Not today. There's probably some... Okay, robbery in progress at the bank. Is that where I was? I don't think I was at the bank. Let's do this. CHP marked unit. Let's go. Uh, bada bing bada boom. Here we go. Let's click J. Let's click L. L. Nope. L does... Wait, yeah. L does do something. Perfect. Also, um, let's see. There's also how the lighting. I should probably tell you guys about. J. You click J once. You got the one steady blinker on one side. Got the steady blinkers up above. Click J twice. Got flashing lights. Flashing lights. Got the flashing lights in the back, so on and so forth. Click J three times. And now you have full blown flashing lights again. I don't I think there's a difference. Let me try again. Turn this off. One, two. I guess two works as well. So what's the difference between Okay, if I click three? I don't know, it looks all the same to me. Oh wait a minute, let me see. One, two. Oh, two only does that much with the blue, but when you click it again for three, it gives you a full-blown blue. Okay, it goes red and blue, red and blue, red and blue. Okay, so that's the difference. And then, of course, guys, you can't be out here testing out a CHP game past a CHP team without turning on this beautiful siren. Oh, look at this. Look at that beautiful siren. All right, let's see. I heard shots. Where, am, where was the shots coming from? Where were the shots coming? I should probably flip and drive properly. Uh-oh. Did I get stuck? Yes, I did get stuck. Woo! That's great. This is why you pay attention while you're driving instead of looking at ambulances and trying to look around at the same time. All right, well, let's try it again. Yes, my luck. All righty, here we are, guys. Once again, back after that dying spree. But here we are. Let's try to find those shots again. I don't know what happened to the menu at all. Or the, the radio communications. <clears throat> Guess we're not going to have any radio. Make this good old fashioned left. Is it a left or a right? I don't know, dude. Because it's so dark now. And I can't see really anything and use anything to cheat. Can I please turn on a light? One, two. Perfect. You got the low beams, high beams. Alright, let me turn this off. Because it seems that all the things are gone. But also, I should probably show you guys another thing you can do with this car. Turn these off. Click. Oh, okay. We're still going. We're, we're still going. Yep. Okay. Three. So then, okay. I'm hearing sirens. Just follow the sirens. Okay. You're off. Perfect. I clicked K, didn't I? Yep. I clicked K. Okay. So if you click K, bada bing. Look at that. You get those left pointing things. So now you can tell people to go to the left. You know, like you're on a traffic stop on this side of the road. Tell people to go to the left. Okay, there's the shots. There's shots. There's shots. Come on. Come on. Where's the guy? Is it this guy? Might be this guy. What's going on here, buddy? No, sir. Oh, wait. This is the perfect time for me to show it off. Oh, why am I always dying? Am I getting shot by like an, by an officer or something? Because how am I dying, dude? How am I not seeing this coming? Can somebody please look back in that footage and tell me where you saw somebody just shoot me and within like a matter of two seconds, not even, I died. Where am I dying from? Who is shooting me? I swear there's probably an officer shooting me. There is no way, dude. Unless they came from like behind and just started shooting, there is no way that I would not even see how I died. The first time I died, that very first time when I was reviewing the stuff, I saw who killed me. I saw a guy was walking around there that looked like a criminal type of person. I just let him go because I was reviewing the thing. This time, I don't know how I died. I do not know. But let me please, just trying to show off what this beautiful, amazing CHP car can do. But let me show it off. All right, here we go. Keep going this way. Oh, wait, that's the LAPD headquarters. All right. I kind of know where I am. Here we are. 
Oh, they chase. They're chasing that guy. Yep, that guy is most definitely being chased. But anywho, now I can do this. All right, turn you off. Click the parking brake. You click K. You go that way. You click K again. You go like that. So now you just basically are just you know just a caution on the road. Click K once again, and you're getting those things where it's like go either way, and then. Look at that, you go that way now, and then K again, and you're off. Now you may be saying, what if I'm on a traffic stop? Well, guess what, you don't have to worry. You click that J button, click it as many times as you want, and then you can click K and bam, you got your front lights going and back lights. But what if you don't want your front lights? You just click it off and bam, you're, you're able to now only have your back lights running. So you're thinking, oh, okay, I'm gonna try to pull this guy over, but you don't want him to know, or like you're following somebody before you pull them over, like, so you're basically just trying to, you know, you're not actually going to do the traffic stop just yet. But you can basically just click these K lights on and have no lights in the front. But the people in the back know something's about to happen. Something is about to go down because this guy has his lights on. So watch out. And then look at that. You know, you just you wait. You're driving around, driving around, following like a couple blocks. All right. This seems like a safe place to pull over. You just boom, boom, boom. Turn on those lights. Do that little thing right there. Boom, man just pulled over. And just like that, you got... Oh, that's the ABS. Whoopsie daisy. You just got them on the side of the road. You do your little thing, and then you're done. Easy breezy. I also should probably show off the secondary siren that they have. Oh, that's ABS. Boom. Amazing. Loving it. I need to make another video on this. This is going to be so great, dude. So amazing so fantastic but if you guys enjoyed this make sure to leave a like subscribe if you want to see more share with all your friends and i'm never mind we're not going to end it off here because there's a guy shooting so we're going to go respond to the guy shooting whoever the guy is shooting let me see where are you at bro where are you at where's the guy with the gun is that him oh wait was that it this is him hey buddy what are you doing what are you shoot wait stop shooting bro Hey, stop shooting. Stop, stop shooting. Can I tase him? I guess this is the perfect time to, to, if you're a taser. Epic card information. Firearms identified card. Okay, I guess you're good, bro. You got a card for it. I was about to say, dude. I was about to just fucking arrest that guy. for just randomly shooting off a gun in the middle of nowhere. All right, but here we go. Now we'll end it off. Since if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, share with all your friends. And I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow. Or maybe even later today with a bonus video. Alright. Bye guys.